Hey, what's up guys? I've got yet another uh, big ol' unboxing for you. I've got a lot of these recently. But I guess this will happen when you go crazy on Black Friday. But um, what I got here is Sherlock, the complete series. And it's just a slip case, it looks like. I was hoping it'd be kind of a better packaging. But at the same time, this is fine. This is easier. Um, it's got all four seasons. As you can see there, one, two, three. I guess that's three. Four. And uh, the Abominable Bride, which is the little special. Um, I have been meaning to buy this show for a while, although I guess season four just came out on, well, I guess it was over the summer, was it, I think it was over the spring, I forget now, it's been a little while now, it's been out for a while, this is the, this is the first time the, um, full four seasons in the special have been released, though, um, which was, I think that was actually just a couple weeks ago it was released, but I got this off of, excuse me, uh, uh, what the hell, uh, barnesandnoble.com. They were having a sale on British television shows, 50% off. And this is on sale for, uh, was, I think it's originally $99, so this was on sale for 50 bucks, And there was a 20% coupon, so I got it. After tax and everything, it was about 40 bucks even, I think. Something like that. So, I almost didn't do it because I've spent so much already on stuff, but I thought, that's the cheapest it's ever going to be, and I do want them. And I'm never apparently going to buy that computer, so I figured, what the fuck. So here it is. I may as well start opening it up now. It isn't, I guess it's not that much to show you, if, if, you, if you've already seen unboxings of these seasons and stuff. It's just the, the individual uh, wrap, well not wrap, but you know, individual seasons. Oops, there we go. Ah, I got it, don't worry. Didn't fall in. I wish the the box was a little thicker, kind of like um, how Game of Thrones does it. Their box sets, so you can tell this is just a flimsy cardboard, which is you know whatever. But this is normally a hundred dollars, so that's kind of whatever. For fifty, for forty bucks, it's like whatever. That's cool. But um, so there it is. There's the front. Just a picture of um, Martin Freeman and Benedict Cumberbatch or Watson and Sherlock, respectively. Uh, for anyone who hasn't seen this show, I mean, uh, it's it's the it's a reimagining of the character of Sherlock Holmes in the modern era. So with cell phones, uh, internet, things like that, and it's actually pretty good. And he's more of a, I think he calls himself a high functioning sociopath, which um, is accurate <laughs> for the show. Um, it's a little actually, as I, again, like I said, the the the, 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 the uh, cardboard is really thin. It's, you can see there's a crease right there. Which is kind of lame, but uh, corners are kind of whatever. I mean, I would be pissed if I paid a hundred bucks for this, and it looked like this. This is really fucking lame, honestly. But uh, for forty, I won't complain too much. I'll still complain, but uh, let's look at this. Lame. Okay, so <clears throat> season one, two discs. Look at this fucking case. They're getting cheaper and cheaper with the cases. This one and two. Let me take the discs out so I can show you more. I've noticed this recently. It's the simple eco cases that are really like very un not protective at all. And then this. Look at this. This I can rip this apart. Remember the old days when they were like it's really solid plastic. I know it's obviously eco friendly and uh, more better for the environment and shit and keeps all these shit away. And but I don't like I could squunch this if I wanted to. Oops, it's kind of moving. I messed up the friggin' artwork in the back. I'm messing around. Hold on. That's better. Season one, I've seen this season, um, in the first episode, actually, a couple times. And at, at FYI, if you, if you don't want to buy the shit the set, it's all, all of the series is on, um, Netflix, which is what I should be have done. What should have done? I should have just watched it on there, but, uh, I wanted the show. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me, Jesus. Um, season two. I think they're all two discs. Um, this has got. Actually, I didn't even say the first season has three episodes, and it's a study in pink. So let me zoom in here. There you go. Study in pink, the blind banker, and the great game. Study in pink is really good. It's a very good introductory episode. Uh, the blind banker. Honestly, I always forget about that one. I think it's only an average episode. And the great game is really good because it introduces uh, uh, Moriarty, which is a pretty good foil for the entire series. Well, for as long as he's around. 
he's not he's not the villain the entire time, but uh, he comes back and forth. He actually he kind of been, he, well, whatever. I'll, I'll shut up. It's it's a good show. Moriarty's awesome. He's he's also a high functioning sociopath. If you know anything about Sherlock Holmes, he is Sherlock's equal, except for villainy. Uh, this is season two, and these episodes are. Oh, I thought they'd be on here. Never mind. Are they not? Am I just missing them? Oh, a scandal in Belgravia. And then Hounds of the ba Hounds of Baskerville. And then the Reichenbach Fall. These are all actually kind of renamings, reimaginings of actual stories, too, I think. Like, I, I recognize the Reichenbach Fall. Obviously, Hounds of Baskerville is the Hounds of the Baskervilles. Hounds of the Baskervilles, or whatever the hell it is. Um, same deal. Two discs and flimsy fucking case. I've only seen this season, like, once. Um, I think it was very similar. I liked the first one. Baskerville's wasn't as good as I'd wanted, but it was still okay. And then Reichenbachfall was very good, if I recall correctly. Season 3, which doesn't say Season 3 on the side, which is kind of whatever, but... Hmm. And this one has... The Empty Hearse, The Sign of Three, and finally His Last Vow. I remember hearing this might have been the last season um, for whatever, because, you know, the, these, the two actors, uh, Benedict Cumberbatch and Martin Freeman, when they started the show, weren't as popular. But after The Hobbit and stuff for him, and then all the shit that he's been doing, and then obviously um, Doctor Strange. Actually, they're both in the Marvel Universe now. Um, they're, they're so busy now that then they can barely keep up with this shit, so I think that's kind of why they released this set, too, that they're basically done. <coughs> Excuse me. And did I already say? Yeah, I did. The last one. And season four, or series four, I actually have only watched the first episode of this, and it was on Netflix. Actually, I think I was recording it on PBS when it first came out, and that was a year ago, I think. So. Um, very cool. Two discs. Same flimsy case. Trying to be sure that this guy, yes. The Six Thatchers, The Lying Detective, and The Final Problem. Yep, I remember the Six Thatchers I watched, but I did not remember the other two Lying Detective and The Final Problem. All the episodes are about an hour and a half, approximately, in length. So they're movie length episodes. Um, so I haven't seen all of that, and this I have not seen any of. I heard this was okay. But I don't know. This is like taking it back to the actual Sherlock Holmes era of the late 1800s. The Abominable Bride. As soon as it's a single disc, yeah. Cool. And that's it. What's that say? Canadian Home Video. Oh. This is a Canadian release? I don't want to say that. That's weird. Maybe it's just the release date. There's no... Actually, there's no... um. French uh, dialogue text on here. That's kind of weird. Well, whatever. Um, that's it. It's a weird unboxing. Um, I wish it, it's actually bothering me now that it doesn't say season three right there. That's kind of weird to me. But whatever. Not a big deal. Let's see, it's already. I just opened this and you can see it's got a scuff on the side there. Lame. Well, anyway, that's it. That's the entire series of Sherlock. I'm assuming that they're done now if they release this because there's no way. Um, it's going to be really hard to get all, all the actors together now. Um, so anyway, that's it. Thank you for watching. Um, I have more stuff to show you. <laughs> and you'll see it eventually, I guess. So, uh, Or you'll see a bunch of stuff before this. I'm actually, I might start uh, staggering my videos because I don't want to release everything at once here. Yeah, it's going to bother me. Look at that. It's not even lined up. Whatever. Who cares? That's not that important. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you around. Uh, I'll see you. I'll talk to you. Whatever. On the internet. <laughs> I don't know how to end this shit. I feel like I'm just saying the same thing over and over again, I guess. So, whatever. Thanks for watching. I'll see you around. See you later.